Hello, hello, hello. How is everyone doing? I hope everyone's doing well. So it's been a long time, y'all. Baby boy is 12 weeks old. I know you guys, I know I've been missing you guys too, but there's just been a lot going on. So we'll talk about it. If you're new to my channel, hey, welcome. Stay a while, hit subscribe. I say that all the time, it's free. If you've been here before, hey, welcome back. Let's continue this journey. I am so sorry that it's been so long since you've heard from me. Anyway, y'all, as you see, I'm in a new office. Remember we were talking about that? The possibility of, yes, yes, of me taking the new job. This is why you guys have not heard from me. So I have taken the new job. Also, though. I'm still working my old job. Yes, y'all. So my old job allowed me to do my job remotely. And the new job, I'm here Monday through Friday. So I'm doing my old job from my laptop and my computer because I'm at 100% occupancy over there. And I can always just call my maintenance man if there's any work orders or anything. And for my renewals, I can go down there once a month and do all that in office. But because of the new outbreak of COVID, yes, the office down there is closed, which gave me an opportunity to come and get my feet wet over here and see if I like it. So far, so good. Um, There's only about an hour, well, it's a two hour drive between my old property and this property. So I've actually been back and forth um, a couple times. Tired, yes, with the capital T, y'all. Tired, especially having a 12 week old at home. However, though, this is all good. Uh, this is all for the family. And oh, what's my hair doing? I'm looking crazy, y'all. The reason I'm keep, keeping both jobs full time is because at my other job, I made a lot less than I'm going to be making here. And every pay for that is going to go towards paying the new car off and paying down bills so that next year when we do this again, we're debt free. So really, my goal was to work two jobs for the next I want to say maybe to the end of the year, but I doubt I go that far. I'm looking at maybe November to when baby boy is six months old, taking every paycheck from that job and applying it one to savings for our next uh, transfer cycle. Yes, we are considering, well, you already knew um, that we wanted to do it again to give him a sibling. Um, so for that and um to pay bills off because i don't want to have two children and be in debt and as you guys know we were technically debt free um until we bought the new vehicle so we bought the new vehicle that we got for sydney in february so i kind of want to at least pay that down as much as possible if not pay it off um it probably won't be paid off well let me see it be paid down quite a bit um quite a bit probably about ten thousand dollars worth of it so you know taking it down that much then that makes just not a lot more payments because i figure between the next couple months then getting pregnant because you're still looking at like next may and then the nine months of the pregnancy i have all that time to focus on getting that vehicle paid off and as you guys know we're trying to buy a home um, so that's all going towards those goals. Um, yes, it sounds crazy. Sydney does store corrections. So we are going back and forth. She's up here on her days off. Um, baby boy is still allowed to come to work with me. So that is a plus. So he still does come into the office here with me because we are technically shut down here too, which is a good thing. So, you know, I can bring him down. It's Saturday. Sydney is off this weekend. So baby boy is with her, but she is here with, with me here now. Um, we do have a unit here at this property too. However, we won't be moving into that until Tuesday of this week because um, we had to find movers to move some of our stuff. So believe it or not, we're going to be living between two homes. We're going to be living between a home in North Carolina and the home here. Um, and like I said, if it wasn't for the goals that we're trying to reach in the next year or two, I would not be doing this, especially with him being so young. Uh, I would rather be sitting at home, loving and hugging all on him all day. But I have to do what I have to do to um, make him have a better life, to make us all have a better life. Um, and I don't feel like I'm losing out on time with him, y'all, because... I still have him with me every day. So even though we're not at home and we're just relaxing, I am in an office environment and I am working, um, he's still with me. 
so that makes things a lot better um what else y'all he has the most amazing personality he has the most amazing personality he's laughing and playing now and kicking his feet and he just he's just such a good sweet baby y'all i just I, I i can't even put how good of a baby he is into words like i feel so blessed i actually reached out to the clinic that um we got the embryo for him from to see if they had another one because what I had thought about doing and you know Sydney's on board is if there was another um embryo straw from his group actually getting pregnant two more times y'all <laughs> so that he would have a biological sibling um do it another time with their like put those embryos on reserve so what I would have actually done is next year or this year coming up doing it with the donated embryos that I had received and then um, the ones with the two female embryos doing it for that. So then be boy, then a girl, and then the embryos that are the same as his doing it the following year. So that means I will probably have a baby at 47, 49, and 50, y'all, which is okay with me. My, my cutoff point was 50. Um, because I did so well, yes, I did have complications after the fact, but because I did so well, I have been approved to do it the second time already. So that's a plus. So I did already get those approvals because I've done so well since he's been born. So yay, yay. Not that conditions have went anywhere. It's just I have snapped back very well. So I'm so excited about that. Um, I don't know if I told you this in the last video about baby boy's heart, but we are going to hold off until December to do anything about that when he's a little older. We can see. So we're just kind of playing the waiting game to see if things get better or what's going to happen in that um, time frame. Hopefully they get better. Hopefully we don't have any issues. Hopefully everything closes up and hopefully the murmur kind of goes away. That's what our hopes and dreams are. Don't know what's going to happen, but that is what the hope is. But, you know, we shall see. Y'all, I'm going to give you all a little tour of where I work so you guys can kind of see. So hold on a second. So if you're coming in the main door, this is RC Mayor. It is outdated, y'all. It really needs a remodel. Um, they should be remodeling it soon, but this is my leasing consultant's office. So yes, here I do have a leasing consultant. So that's a very good thing. You know, we give the, the coffees out for the guests that are coming. My office, I have not decorated anything yet because I just started. But my office, there it goes. And here's a surround of what you just saw. And then here's like the sitting meeting area, kitchen area. We do have a handball court here, y'all. I'm like, it's fancy. It's real fancy in here. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it, but it is a handball court in there. I uh, see. I'm trying to get the glare off. Now, Okay, but I think you got that there. So we got a handball court. I think it's really, really cool. And then through here, so I'm giving you a tour. So if anybody want to come to the Glen Allen, Virginia area, hey. <laughs> come see me, give me a shout out. <laughs> we have a fitness center, so it's definitely a lot more bougie than where I was at. Oh, there I am. Hello, y'all. Mm, how am I looking? All right, kind of cute. <laughs> anyway, yes. Yeah, so, and then we have a two-level pool, but I will show you that. I'm gonna come back through. Beautiful two-level pool. I love it. I love this place, y'all. I could not pass it up. As much as I love where I was working at, as much freedom. I had where I was working at I just could not pass up this opportunity it is a once in a lifetime opportunity but we do have a two tiered pool I'm not going to really film like that because I do have some residents in the pool but it's a two tiered pool area with the grill y'all it's something serious I love it but I'll get right back to you look who came to see me at work my lunchtime, look who came to see me at work. Say hi. Say hi. 
Why? Don't want to talk? My little chicken nugget, you don't want to talk? Say no. No. You see yourself? There's my other sweetheart. Say hi. <laughs> they came to visit me. They're going to go get in that pool. Unfortunately, I can't get in. You want to fuss? You like, get away from me, camera? Oh, he is not for the camera, y'all. Not at all. <laughs> you better get used to it. This is why he was fussing, y'all. Mm -hmm. He was ready to eat. You ready to eat? You ready to eat? Lunchtime? Yeah, he was like, y'all are going to sit there and eat, and then I'm not going to eat no food. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, I got to eat too. No? You done? Got a healthy appetite. You see a little boy is healthy. Ooh. Showing. They want to see you. How big you getting. Big handsome gentleman. He's no. long. He's long. Yes. Well, he's short, but he's long to us now. Done? Mm -hmm. He trying to hold his bottles. We won't be doing it fast enough for him, but of course he can't yet. And then he holds my finger, which I think is the cutest little thing. Hey, yeah, that little boy's getting big. What are you doing with the bottle? You know you on the camera because you normally look at me. You're looking at that camera. <laughs> <laughs> I guess because I keep going in and out, in and out, and turning away. You like mommy's new job? <laughs> you like mommy's new job? You're watching your other mommy hard. <laughs> y'all, he's gonna follow y'all. <laughs> Shout out to my camera woman, huh? <laughs> All angles. All angles? No, okay. I think you're over it, huh? Does he have a boogie? I don't think so. You were just <laughs> in there, huh? I was trying. <laughs> you done? <laughs> the mood just flowing. It's a bad thing. Thank you. <laughs> Go smile. Come smile. Come smile. <laughs> You're looking like, what is that? <laughs> My little cutie patootie, you not gonna smile? No. Smile. 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 There you go. They want to see that big, pretty smile. Smile. Smile for me, Justice. No. You're gonna smile. There you go. <laughs> there you go. There's the milk. <laughs> no smiling. <coughs> they want to see your cute self. It's been a while since they saw you. But you're not going to talk to them? No, you be talking all kinds of gibberish. No talking? No. He probably wants to burp. <laughs> no, he hasn't burped enough. No. All right. Okay. Little boy about to go swimming. Cold, of course. It's like 90 something degrees out here today. Oh, that's what kind of swimming they gonna do. <laughs> they gonna do they're gonna do stairway swimming. Uh, gonna kick. Go kick. 
No kickins. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Hi, thing. No kicking. No kicking. Oh. Oh, have fun, thing. Have fun. <laughs> Okay, are we swimming now? Looks like we got our mojo going. We off the steps. Justice. Justice, are you swimming? Justice. Are you swimming? Are you swimming, big boy? You like the water. You like the water. You're such a big boy. Such a big boy, yay! We're swimming. <laughs> Some straight out legs, I know. <laughs> what are you doing, little boy? What are you doing? Are you Superman in it? <laughs> are you Superman in it? Kick, kick, yay! <laughs> well y'all i guess that's the end of the video you got to see my baby cakes hey baby cakes baby cakes hi <laughs> really got to see both my baby cakes gonna say bye bye's gonna say bye 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 Say bye bye, Justice. No. All right, y'all. Bye. Hopefully, I can get some videos out a lot sooner. Now that I'm going to be a little bit more stable between both locations. And we will talk to you later. Bye.